Okay, grab it, grab it, grab it. What's going on everybody fishing the odds here down on the Oregon coast with my family and uh, tomorrow I'm going to be floating a river down here in hopes to get some coho and chinook and, and uh, I think we're in some luck guys there's some fish in these rivers right now and might as well kill two birds with one stone go down to the coast with the family hang out enjoy the beach and, and fish some rivers so look at this beautiful sight we got Got the fire going. So I will see you guys in the morning. Gonna be waking up in the hotel and hitting the road. I think we're gonna get some fish. Hit that subscribe button. Two videos a week. Also follow me on Instagram, guys. I got more adventure trips like this coming up all the time, so stay tuned. Morning, everybody. Hotel room's a mess. Gonna be loading up the, uh, the truck right now. Check it out. We got the coffee brewing. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let's load the truck up. Out with my buddy Ling Ling. He's got a tackle shop in Tillamook. We'll be talking about that in a little bit here, but we're in his nice little uh, wooden drift boat here. We're going to be taking this thing down a river up in, on the Oregon coast and and hopefully we get on some Chinook guys. And uh, is there any coho in here yet, Ling Ling? Oh yeah. There's some coho around so hopefully we get some coho. But we need some rain. The water's kind of low. Uh, it, it's, got, it's got a lot of visibility but nevertheless we're going to fish these deep pockets to try to get some Chinook in here and hit that subscribe button guys. Stay tuned. I got two videos, three videos coming out a week and uh, we're going to have a good time. Just uh, fish in clear water, and it's low and clear. You can probably see the bottom, guys. Jane clear. Tough fishing, but a couple bobber down better than that. Yep, had a coho on. We'll get a fish by the end of the drift, we're hoping. Little update, guys. I had uh, actually three bobber downs total. One of, one of them was uh, a small coho, but the first one, was a nice coho that we had lost. Uh, I got a whole bunch of head shakes out of it. We just couldn't get the camera fast enough and I'm not running the GoPro right now, so. We're seeing some fish. We're seeing some fish in here. I'm trying to get them to go on some eggs. Come on. Chrome. Bring it this way. It's 
the chrome fish. The chrome right in the right in the beak. Oh, fresh. <laughs> oh, on the CB jig, yeah. That is a fresh fish. <laughs> Ooh. Look at that, sea lice. Oh, you got the jig out. Yep. Pull it up, baby. <sighs> Look at that. Oh, thank you, Alex. <laughs> Right on, man. That's awesome. Right in the chomper. That's a beautiful fresh fish. We worked at that fish for a while. Here you go. out of this hole we're gonna go ahead to a different one that was fun though yeah how do you feel after uh after i lost a couple fish today on some eggs i feel good because <laughs> <laughs> i was struggling there for a minute I was like i had two bobber downs not sure if they were the bottom or not and then whack that was a good fish right on man yeah hopefully we get one more before we're done with the day heck yeah it's been a good day floating the river so far. Still got plenty of time. Oh, it is? Yeah. See it? Oh, yeah. Just got this nice chum, guys. Man, these fish sure do fight hard. We're gonna, we're gonna release this fish, but we're gonna let it rest here for a minute. How much do you think that one weighs? Oh, dude, 15, 14. So, the hammer your twitching jig. Yeah. Come come close. Let's get a nice release. Get close up. Right there. There he goes. There he goes. There you go. Hey guys, I'm Casey out on Ling Ling's Tackle Box. It's uh, over on 405 Main Street, located right across from the U.S. Bank. And uh, as you can see, we're, we're pretty successful here on the water. It was a hard day and we got one. So come right check on. him out. I'm open four to four and got all the fresh sand shrimp and gear you guys need. He does. It's a killer little shop, guys. Go check it out right there in Tillamook, baby. Heck yeah. Day's done. All right, guys, <clears throat> all done with our day here. I, I caught a chum and, and uh, lost a couple coho, and we got this huge dime bright coho here. Just look at the size of that thing. It's like 12 pounds. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. 
That's a nice fish, man. It's a super nice fish, and uh, we're grateful for the day that we had. It's been a it's been a tough last few days for me down here on the Oregon coast, but we floated this river in uh, Ling Ling's um, drift boat, and we just had a killer time. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Um, what do you got to say, Ling Ling? Oh, thanks for the day. That was fun. Yeah, we had a good time, and. Uh... This thing slammed the twitching jig, so I was... Slammed it. Yeah, it was super hard, low clear water, and it started out like winter still had fish in. I mean, yeah, we my were feet cold. almost fell off. We were as uh, cold as you can get. Yeah, and then uh, about a quarter way down, it started warming up, so I think it turned the bite on a little bit and got, a, got one. Oh yeah. Tight lines, guys. Hit that subscribe button.